Good afternoon. A German man has been killed and two others injured, including a British man, in a knife and hammer attack in central Paris, close to the Eiffel Tower. A 25-year-old man has been arrested. Olivia Guthrie has this report. In the shadow of the Eiffel Tower, a knife and hammer attack is unleashed on the French capital. The interior minister arriving swiftly at the scene. Ce soir, à Paris, uh... Tonight in Paris, he says, a man attacked a tourist couple, stabbing and killing a German man. He did not attack the woman after an intervention from a nearby taxi driver. The attacker moved on and police started chasing him. He attacked two more people, one with a hammer, but their lives are not in danger. It's reported one victim who sustained injuries to his head and face is a British man in his 60s. Officers tasered the suspect, a French national known to intelligence services. The 25-year-old was jailed for four years in 2016 for plotting another violent attack. The motive for last night's incident is still unclear. What I do know, says the interior minister, is the attacker allegedly shouted, Allah Akbar, God is great. He also told officers he was angry about seeing Muslims die, France's relationship with Israel and the situation in Gaza. This will no doubt bring back painful memories of the Paris attacks which killed 130 people here eight years ago. France today remains under a heightened terror alert. Olivia Guthrie, ITV News.